No, no. First off, heal. And save. Because during all the previous recording attempts, I died by the hands of these jackasses. That's what. That <laughs> and I accidentally knocked him into the spikes. Make this guy a lot easier. And yeah, just see how fast you can attack with those claws. Very fast. Ah, interrupted their com yeah, inter their conversation, <laughs> and then just kill them. That was easy. Yeah, this is what you get when you tell orcs to guard your shrine. Any aspect of Asha should be smarter than that. Let's see if we can get a stealth kill like this. Where are we? Ah, oh, no. Too bad. That would be nice for a possible Dark Messiah too. De well, or demonic uh, stake you know, down, so something like similar. Probably, yeah, they, if they may uh, uh, get uh, demon form again in this in a possible sequel. Although it seems very strong to me, well, uh, very unlikely to me. Solar Eater staff here, and this chest contains some armor and healing. Uh, just opening this one because I don't need to backtrack for it. Plate armor, shadow steel daggers, mana potion. And I won't be picking up mana potions and healing anymore because I got uh, a. I got the healing spell, and b. I got over 30 mana potions. Okay, I'll try to get rid of these guys stealthily. One should be wa should come walking back over here, or else uh, uh, here he comes. Here they come. Let's see if we can take the one. Yeah. No, nope. stop or die, both of them. The only one who'll be dying is you, are you guys? You see how fast you can cut through them. I wonder what the stealth is generally attack in the demon form does. A cyclops in captivity. I'm impressed. Probably guarding the exit. Yeah, get over here, you big log. I'm trying to get these shorts. There we go. That should yes, that yes. hurt. Destroy it. That all <laughs> immediately got him down. And there we go, wipe off the you know, sword in a badass way. <laughs> Yeah, that was very quick. Magnificent. Killing Cyclops. Such potency. My okay. wonderful Sarah. You are a worthy heir to your father. And a worthy successor. Okay. I'm putting these rope bows here just to show how you can reach a place over there. Yeah, uh, when you can find a Master Thief's outfit, you can see it's just, well, you just can't see it. It's on top of that plank. Uh, so it's out of reach of telekinesis because you can't see it. And I won't be gr uh, climbing up there just to get that. Uh, because I'm uh, part of, because I'm sick with enough, uh, constantly having to re-record, you know, well, re-attempt to you know, get a good recording with this part. Which is also why I'm going to make this recording just uh, uh, two videos instead of three or four. Because I just want to get past this point. The Cyclops battle is quite interactive. Uh, if you uh, <coughs> if you uh, hide under here, the Cyclops will actually lift this, you know, throw this uh, rock out of the way. And if you hide behind you know, that rock, he will stick his head in and try to grab you. But for I've now, move on. Let's go. Hmm. Uh, I wonder if we can climb up there somehow. Yeah, how can we, huh? How? It's more than obvious, and that I missed. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not getting that Master Thief's outfit that's in there because I can find one a bit later. Uh, probably in a. Uh, in the next two videos or so. And then I believe those are the only two in the entire game. 
Okay. Go up here. And watch it. With, if you fall down, of course, it hurts. A lot. So... Oh, there we go. And let's get out of here. Finally. Or clear those works. Good riddance. We'll have to do something about this place once you come into power. Let's get out okay. first. Of course, my prince. Okay, there are a lot of spiders around this place, but I'm just ignoring them. I've always ignored them, just ran straight past them. Sorry, ah, <laughs> bugger still got me. I tried to jump over him. Stealth 3, now I can use Shadow Steel Daggers and the Poison Chris. And yes, I'll switch, uh, I'll switch this up a bit. Uh, poison Chris there and Shadow Steel's over there because I'm mo when uh, I'm getting to combat it'll mostly be with orcs and then I'll just get uh, go into demon form to take care of them. Uh, yes, uh, Shadow Steel daggers just do more damage. Poison Chris will uh, poison an enemy if you hit him with a power strike, and um, but after that we'll have to recharge for a bit. Don't know to what extent uh, the poison works, just uh, don't know if it works until a certain amount of health has been reached, 5 points or so, or if it just goes on until it kills an enemy. I never tried, never cared, because I never really used the poison quiz. Over there I've tried uh, a couple of times getting in there, but uh, it's nothing. If you try to climb there by rope, it'll just say you fell to your death. Yeah. Easy kill. A satisfying stream. Okay, really don't need to pick up any more mana stuff. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Okay, I've got one more thing. Yeah, also something I'd uh, say which would be nice for a possible sequel. Uh, Yet you can just throw your knives while completely stealthed. But uh, to balance that out, you'll probably you would probably have to uh, retrieve your daggers. And they are going to warm themselves by the fire. I'll just try to sneak past. Oh, ah, yes, something you can use. See how close we can get. Now that he's dead, this guy will probably see his corpse. Go investigate. And then I can backstab him also. Ah, but I just missed that by a second. Okay, so people who've watched my let's play of uh, Time Shift may have noted that uh, at times I you know, disarmed enemies and let them live. And, uh, and might wonder, uh, hey, uh, didn't you uh, li used to uh, let... Uh, uh, enemies live if they were unarmed and that uh, is the answer to that is yes but uh, with the goblins and such in this game well, with enemies and such in this game they will uh, you know, they will come back at you know, if, uh, they will just run back and there we go uh, that's uh, I'd, I'd take that as evidence that uh, the enemy uh, that poisoning an enemy will uh, kill him if eventually, but it would take too much time. Okay, I'll cut the video off in a bit, but first let me explore in here, if there's something over here. It's just a dead end. And that's a long way down. <laughs> okay, no, nothing over here. Oh yes, yeah, so something about this area, uh, goblins will continue to respawn from uh, some point over there. 
So uh, if you want, if you like fighting goblins, this is a good place to mess around with them. In an area with some spell and uh, with some stuff, that stone closes it again. And here we can find an orc in captivity. But uh, that will uh, be for later. So uh, this has been Let's Play Dark Messiah and Mighty Magic of uh, <coughs> and Hearts. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, but next time we'll uh, get it. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll leave the young goblin outpost and uh, have a chat with uh, that orc. But until then, have a nice day and goodbye.